The cancellations continue in the sports world today. The NTNT IndyCar Series announced that the series has canceled all events through the month of April. Yeah, so what does that mean for the rest of the series and its schedule? Charlie Clifford joining us now live from the Indianapolis Motor Speedway. And uh, Charlie, I guess the qu best question for us tonight is when will the cars be back? It's a great question, Phil, and your answer is May right here behind me at the Indianapolis Motor Speedway for the Indy GP. The first four races of the 2020 season canceled. The hope is that they may be able to circle back and get these venues with cars on the track before the season's over. But this was the last pro sports domino to fall today. Earlier this afternoon, the Masters postpones the 2020 play in Augusta, Georgia, and also NASCAR canceling this weekend's race in Atlanta and next weekend in Miami. As for St. Petersburg, this is a complete 180 from what we heard yesterday. Mayor Nick Krenzman said yesterday, we're going on without the fans in St. Pete. Today, Mark Miles hops on a conference call, the president of IndyCar saying, this is unfit to race even without fans. He cited Disney closing its doors and also the decision made by golf earlier today. As Miles looks ahead to May, the work that remains between tonight and the 104th Indianapolis 500, it is not a short list. Our hope, our ambition, and our plan is to restart in May and to uh, get in as much as a, of a season as we can. And I know that our promoters, you know, are going to assess their individual situations as well. Um, we'll. We'll be, you know, every day, every hour, talking to suppliers, to the paddock, to our sponsors, our broadcasters, and our promoters, and we'll, we'll put on as big a show as we possibly can this year. The 500 this year is supposed to be amazing anyway, um, with the, you know, with the crowd that's going to be there. So now you can see people that are really, weren't planning on coming, that are still wanting to get their racing fixed. They're going to come to Indy now, and it's just going to be an amazing event. You know, the Grand Prix is probably, hopefully, going to be sold out as well as the 500, and it's just going to be, a, it's going to be something uh, to watch for a lot of people. Again, four races canceled to start the season. Later here at 6 o'clock on Wish TV, Graham Rahal joins us from St. Petersburg. His thoughts as the drivers are now waking, making their way back towards Indianapolis. Also, Olivia Ray with a touching story on the NCAA side, how one local team that planned on going to the big dance is now stuck at home for now at the Indianapolis Motor Speedway. Charlie Clifford, Wish TV News 8. Charlie, thank you.